What's going on guys? It's Matt here and we are here in Milan. Um, I'm getting ready for my day. It's already 10 o'clock. I slept like 9 hours. And I'm going to show you what I'm going to eat and then, <clears throat> and then I'm going to show you some parts of Milan as well as maybe something else. It's done in the evening but that's still making. But at least I'm going to show you some part of Milan and some outside workout because it's decent outside. So here's my first meal of the day, and that's obviously oats, kiwi, dark chocolate, and raisins. Macros are going to be listed here. But we have to add some yogurt just for taste. Oh, and I almost forgot. Bio, no GMO, organic, however you guys going to call it, eggs, just to got my stuff ready, some camera equipment and my the best of the best phone. Let's go to drink some coffee and uh, kill some legs workout. This is my camera equipment. Nice, huh? Pretty smooth. But I'm really considering to, to buy some real camera. I'm so into it, so but I just have to utilize the equipment what I have right now and show you guys some life in Milan. By the way, the, the, the lighting in, in the elevator is always the best. So yeah, this is where I live. This is the entrance and corridor. neighborhood so the plan is basically to go and drink my pre-workout which is going to be um, the coffee in my favorite spot which is uh, Italy they they doing really good coffee that's gonna be the coffee at Oppio so yeah I decided to take some time off from the gym because as you guys could see in my previous video the gym was like 250, 400, whatever just preposterous and I'm gonna stay here only for like two weeks more, or maybe three something along, along those lines and I have so much downtime in my, in my work so I, I just decided to, to do a lot of push-ups out there and, and focus my, maybe more on, the, on my body weight and just to utilize the training with my own body weight, basically. And that's going to be a nice break for, from, uh, from my gym routine, because I was going to the gym like, I don't know, from less than years. So it's, it's kind of nice to, to, to take some time off from the gym. And, and yeah, that's it. I'm gonna show you guys what you can do when you are on a vacation or when you are in a hotel room or basically how you can uh, train your legs without uh, much equipment and just your body weight. Now on my way to grab some coffee, which is going to be my pre-workout. That's also an ice break from uh, all this, you know, supplements and then pre-workouts and stuff. And I'm gonna show you guys uh, the place where they have the best coffee in Milan. At least in my opinion. <laughs> So that's probably nice and probably useless, 
nobody has ever used that, at least I haven't seen it. As you guys might be aware, I just cannot get my legs any bigger because it's modeling and my legs are already kind of huge. So I have to be really careful in terms of like, you know, putting some size and trust me, they are growing so much faster than my upper body. It's because of uh, I was playing basketball and half of my life I was, uh, you know, spending in the squat position, basically. Now it's so much easier for me to, to grow my my legs that's the advice for you if you don't want uh, your legs to get bigger but maybe you know a bit leaner or you know develop some muscles but not necessarily like you know huge muscles this training might be for you it might be good for you so this place is quite similar as you guys were able to see in my last video from from miami it's pretty much the same equipment but it's much 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 smaller how are you doing guys it's much smaller but yeah nice weather so there's a lot of people working out so the weather is quite nice it's, it's a bit cold but you know it's sunny so that's the, the most important thing and let's this party roll So I'm gonna start my workout with some squats. You know, it has to be a lot of volume because, you know, there's not much weight involved beside my body weight. So you have to do, you know, quite a lot of repetitions to even feel something. So we're gonna do some squats as a warm up. then we're gonna do some single leg squats and then we're gonna keep going. So I'm trying to keep the brakes pretty short 
around like 60 to 90 seconds just to keep the intensity pretty high like I said there is no weight involved so beside my body weight so you gotta keep that workout pretty intense now we're gonna move to single leg squat and that's going to be quite heavy we'll see how it's gonna play out usually my left leg is far stronger than, than, than the right one that's because of um, the basketball and I've always been starting and landing and everything on my left leg so let's see how it's gonna play out So single leg, a squat, it was quite heavy, five reps each leg and uh, yeah, uh, that, this is also um, the nice balance exercise. My energy level was at the beginning was, was super nice and then all of a sudden just crashed. I don't know what, why I went through that and now I am on my way to the agency. I gotta figure it out something and you know make some uh, stuff straight and then I'm gonna get you guys to the surprise. So we are at the Via Senato and that's the headquarters of Moschino. For those of you who are like me and you were saying Moschino, you were wrong. That's Moschino. It's always good to learn something new. <laughs> So in the agency, taxes, 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 no joke. So I just got off the agency, great team of people, they, they do understand my, my position. I thought I'm gonna stay for the entire month of February, but unfortunately I have to short it for around like two weeks and I have to go to, to Poland and do surgery. It's not easy for me, but I have to do it and sooner I'm gonna make it happen, it's gonna be better for my health definitely and for my heart especially. So that being said, it's time for uh, the post-workout meal and that's the place where I'm gonna get you guys is the perfect place for the bodybuilders. The, you pay once and you eat as much as you want and the food is so delicious. 
it's hard to even describe it. And there is a drink included, so that's that's decent too. You can you can choose the virgin drink or you can choose wine, you can choose whatever you want, margaritas, Long Island, sex on the beach, whatever the hell you like. Nice house in the background. So yeah, that's on my way. Aperitivo. <laughs> security but yeah means that anything can happen at any moment <laughs> Central Park in New York City. A lot of people, a lot of tourists, very nice atmosphere. Here and there is quite sketchy. So here we are nearby the Arco de la Pacha. In my opinion, that's the place where they have the best, absolutely the best aperitivo. In, uh, in Milan and I'm gonna show you how much can I eat in one dinner and that's gonna be quite a lot because I am just on like around 1000 maybe 1500 calories and I have way more to go so I because I walk like a lot a lot a lot <laughs> take the aperitivo you're gonna pay like 12 euros and you're gonna have the full buffet and you can eat as much as you want and I'm gonna choose non-alcoholic quattro frutti potatoes um, buckwheat green beans that's probably couscous I believe cabbage and all of that and uh, chicken, rice, that I have no idea what, some pasta, white cheese, cheese, bruschetta, pineapple, some desserts, snacks, that's a bad building session, <laughs> chicken, uh, some high calories, 
that's probably pasta. Here we got a um, big chunk of uh, pork. Oh, here we are, the top shelf. No idea what's that. Obviously carrots. Um, that's the cabbage. And uh, that's kind of paella, pretty decent. Another salad, hams. And next, another pasta, some uh, potatoes, that's probably meatballs or whatever. Yeah. And there's my drink. And now let's start to put some plates. So here we go, plate number one. Plate number three. I just started to eat, I'm sorry, I forgot about that. <laughs> so that's protein mostly, which is chicken, pork, and some cabbage. And there's the extra gift, pizza. And trust me, this is the best one what I have ever eaten in this. Plate number four. Potatoes, chicken, pork, uh, rice, white rice. Potatoes, okay, high rice. Um, pasta, pork, pineapple. It's pretty cold again, but I got my scarf from my girlfriend, so that's that's very nice. And gloves as well. So yeah, I have eaten five plates. And I could eat margarita pizza as well. And trust me, this one is by far the best what I have eaten in terms of pizza in Milan. But obviously I'm a model, so I have to count calories, so I couldn't go, you know, as crazy as I, as I wish I would go. I have not eaten it. They have regular plates and regular silverware because in the other places mostly what they offer is plastic silverware and plastic plates and all of that and this is just out of my i don't know ethical <laughs> capacity i would put it that way i'm full i'm full and i have like 25 minutes to go home <clears throat> so that's going to be a really nice walk i feel like that's the the best thing what can happen to <laughs> to the guys who are doing intermittent fasting and then kind of that thing. <laughs> I don't know, lunch and then the aperitivo for 12 euros and then you're all set. Here we are in the Chinatown. You can buy some crazy stuff in here. Yeah, if you want to experience quite a bit of China, you can always come over here. And I found that uh, store quite interesting. Back to the apartment. Whew. That was an exhausting day. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'm gonna end it up this video here. If you enjoyed it, click the like button, subscribe, share with your friends. I need that support. <laughs> and yeah, I will see you guys on to the next one.